Hello everyone, Ace here, and today let's talk about the demise of CNN Plus, the new streaming service from the establishment that will shut down on April 30th, just over a month after it had launched, which has occurred following the abysmal performance of this new streaming service. And needless to say, this is no doubt a victory for the crowd that actually promote free speech and honest reporting. That said, there is a little bit more to this story that keeps it from being quite the epic victory that some are claiming. Or at the very least, this is the narrative being provided by at least some establishment news sources, so like always, feel free to of course take this with a grain of salt. But to understand what I'm talking about, let's look at this article from CNBC, written by Alex Sherman, titled, CNN Plus will shut down April 30th, just one month after launch. And as already mentioned, this particular article does indeed go over the fact that CNN Plus only managed to bring in around 10,000 viewers each day on average, as well as go over the fact that CNN Plus head Andrew Morse is leaving the company as well. And once again, these are signs that the establishment news media has indeed suffered a defeat here. But let's now talk about the narrative that is being pushed by CNBC. As they state, quote, Warner Brothers Discovery hasn't officially outlined its streaming plans and ambitions. But as CNBC has previously reported, the goal is to combine HBO Max and Discovery Plus with other programming from Warner Media, including potentially live news and sports, and offer all of the content together as a Netflix competitor. If the goal is to maximize the number of subscribers for the big bundle, dedicating resources to CNN Plus, rather than folding that programming into the larger bundle, could be antithetical to the company's strategy. In other words, CNBC is trying to argue that Warner Brothers wants to merge all of its streaming services into one big bundle in order to directly compete with Netflix. And in addition, it should also be noted that the linked CNBC article is from early February of 2022, before CNN Plus even launched. And in that article, it states, quote, Key executives at Discovery view CNN's value as supporting a bulkier flagship product, featuring content from HBO Max and Discovery Plus, along with streaming sports, said the people familiar with the matter, who asked not to be named because the executive's perspective are private. They believe there's less value in CNN Plus as its own paid subscription service, said the people familiar with the thinking. In other words, it is heavily implied that the fate of CNN Plus was sealed before the streaming service was even launched. Although it is worth noting that in both of the articles that we have covered, CNBC tries to rely on anonymous experts as sources. And simply put, an anonymous expert is not a source. For this reason, I believe that this article is still in the territory of speculation. Although it is most certainly speculation that is at least plausible. That said, I wouldn't exactly be surprised if some of the programs on CNN Plus find their way onto larger streaming services. But regardless, the statistics and figures that are available regarding CNN Plus do suggest that it is an abysmal failure on its own front. And it is my opinion that regardless of what Warner Brothers had originally planned, the utterly terrible performance of CNN Plus was going to make the streaming service collapse inevitably anyways. This appears to have just simply sped up the process. And while CNN Plus will most certainly face its demise on April the 30th, it is likely that at least some of the programs from it will carry on, albeit on life support, provided by being part of a larger streaming service. So at the end of the day, this is still once again a victory against the pro-censorship and anti-truth establishment. But it does not appear to be quite the grand victory that some are making it out to be. Now, of course, for those curious, I will be leaving links in the description below to archives of both of the articles mentioned so you can check them out for yourselves. But in any case, this has been Ace. Hope to see you guys again soon. Take care. Ace out.